Welcome to another episode of Great HR's How to Video Series. It's time for you to start collecting proof for the investment declaration provided by employees for their TDS or income tax calculation for the financial year. This video will discuss how admin can manage the employee proof of investment. With Great HR's Proof of Investment module, completing this activity becomes easy and hassle-free. Using the Great HR Proof of Investment module, you can customize your proof of investment settings. Release and manage employee proof of investment declaration. Review and manage employee proof of investment submissions. Finally, consider the proof of investment declarations for payroll processing. The proof of investment overview page in the Great HR admin portal offers a systematic process for managing the complicated process of submitting proof of investment for admins. The page displays information such as how many employees the proof of investment declaration form is yet to release and released. How many employees submitted the form and are pending action and the list of employees for whom the proof of investment submissions are pending for payroll and considered for payroll. Each tab helps you in performing specific tasks. These tasks enable you to complete the proof of investment process smoothly. Before you get started, click here on the proof of investment settings icon to adjust the settings related to proof of investment as per your requirements. Under the general settings, enable the family details mandatory for dependent claims checkbox if required. By enabling this, family details become mandatory for any dependent claims. Enter the general instructions here. This will be visible on the proof of investment declaration page. Check this option to consider previous employment details updated by the admin for final income tax computation. Enable this option to allow the employees to submit income from previous employer details in both IT declarations and the proof of investment page. Customize the proof of investment attachment from the attachments section. Enable the checkbox to allow employees to change the regime while submitting proof of investment. This option will allow the new joinee without IT declaration to select a regime during the proof of investment declaration. Click here to allow employees to acknowledge their proof of investment declaration. Finally, you can enter the declaration note employees must accept before submitting the proof of investment. Remember to save the changes. With that, we come to an end. Thank you for watching the great HR how to video series.